Right, hi, this is Exploring with Em and Stu. I'm Em. And I'm Stu. And today we've been walking along the Norfolk Coast Park and we've stumbled across what appears to be a derelict campsite. Yep, and it looks like they're actually tearing it down now, so we've come just in time before it all goes. Yeah, this area is well known for coastal erosion, so we believe they've obviously cleared out the caravan park and moved it somewhere else from what we believe. Yep. Um, because, of, because it's too dangerous. But there's still a few bits left. So, so we're going to take you we're around it. A explore a bit. So we haven't done something like this for a while, have That's we? a little so bit of an urbex for you, a little bit of enjoyment yeah, while I was out on a out. walk. Alright then. So let's get to it. See you in a minute. Yes. Right, okie dokie. Uh, we're about to go and have a look in a caravan. There's three left. Yeah, we thought there was more, but there was more they when. Are currently in the middle of the yeah, um, if you check the links, link out of Tom Outdoors' video for this because we'll put yeah, it in. Yeah, Tom Outdoors when he did the the Norfolk Coast Park. Yeah, we'll put the link in for it for his video and you can see a lot more caravans up this end. But as we've well cut a lot more of the coast. Oh, a lot more. Thing, yeah, so yeah, exactly. Which so we're check... hoping to do one day. Yeah, we'll check his video out, you can see it. But we're gonna go and have a look at a few of these caravans before they're gone. There's only three left now, or four, if you include the one on its side over there. <laughs> but we're gonna go and have a look. There's a few little sheds, a few little areas that are quite of interest. So let's go and do this, so we'll see you in a second. Right, Emma's coming into this caravan. We're having a look. Is, this is really eerie, isn't it? Do you know what? This yeah. is proper eerie. Oh my god, it's just really weird. It looks like they literally just packed their bags and just went, doesn't it? There's all stuff here still. I mean, what does this newspaper say? Um, oh, October 2018. Really? Yeah. yeah, but that doesn't necessarily mean that it's closed, it's closed no. Because people could have been uh, squatting in here, couldn't they? Yeah, anything really. About a bit. Yeah. Almost feel like I should put it back. Well, don't put it back. Don't touch nothing. Oh, really? Wow! Look at this. This is actually pretty cool in here. It's got like weird cupboards. Don't know. This is like the main bedroom. This is actually really cool, you know. Oh, it's got... not actually that old a caravan. You could still have had a holiday. Oh, I wouldn't want to go in that toilet, but you've got like the bathroom in there. Lovely. There's not much you can see in a caravan, but it's worth worth having a look. Take snaps. Yeah. But there I you mean, go. You know, as they always say, like you know, there's worse there's worse caravans at host seasons. I think there's worse co case when you go to uh, park resorts, isn't it? <laughs> you got old, look at this old picture thing down here. Look at that. That's oh, pretty this amazing. Is actually really sweet, isn't it? Yeah, it's actually a. Tell what a waste. This is actually quite a nice caravan. Despite it being smashed a bit. Yeah. Okay. Well, there's not a lot you can actually see in here, guys. But um, I'm going to wait outside while Emma does her pictures. But I think we've seen quite a bit, don't you think, Em? Yeah. All right. Okay. So I'll meet you outside. Right, okie dokie, you've got one more caravan to check out before we get caught being actually on here. Yeah, so we think the end might turn up to always the Yeah, so we're going to get in there because this caravan's got curtains up and we've got less shots to be seen. Unless there's like shots and everything. It's really quite eerie, this It's very, very eerie. But we're going to check it out, so let's get in there, check this out, get yeah. some pictures and get back out again. <laughs> See you in a minute. We've got a boogie board there, look. Looks a bit worrying, doesn't it? Do you know what? It's really not easy. Do you know what? It's just really weird. Are you filming? 
Yeah, yeah, it's just really weird. So it don't feel right. No, I don't. I think it's because, oh, I don't know, they are, they are eerie, aren't they? They're very eerie. You don't know who's been staying in these, do you? No. But it's like they've just up and left. Oh, this one's got some graffiti, which I'm not going to be showing. Is it rude? Uh, no, it's just not going to show it. Got all the plates and candles and... Quite surprised they've never been burnt down. That's the thing. Got, oh, this is old. We've got a VCR player in here. Yeah. Yeah. Quite amazing. Not a lot, again, not a lot to see, but just really incredibly interesting. Let's, let's have a there look must in. be a toilet in there. Yeah. Now that is actually reasonably quite clean for a little toilet. That's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. It's still got the ladders in here. Old coat hangers and the blinds. Obviously, I reckon people that have been homeless probably have stayed in here. Well, why not? And I wouldn't blame them. I wouldn't blame them at all. Right, I'll leave them to get her pictures, and uh, it's we'll. Difficult um, to get pictures. Yeah, I know. It's so small, isn't but it? we'll. I'll meet you back outside. Bye. Bye. Right, um, as you can probably see, we've got just in the distance, just here is where the electric boxes are, but we believe that these sheds were the back of caravans. Yeah. Probably were housed washing machines, tools, you know, things like that. I mean, people might have stayed here for the whole, what, nine or ten months of the year, yeah. however long it was open. Well, yeah, exactly, you never know. But we just having a look round here. This is obviously a caravan plot. And here we go, we've got a, we've got a, a lead for a, a lawnmower. God, you know what? I know the camera can't pick up the smell, but it still smells like lawnmower and everything in there. And I don't know how long it's been closed for, no. which is pretty cool. Um, we're going to be just going around here because I mean, there's only a couple of seconds we could take of these sheds because who wants to see loads of different sheds that are exactly the same? Yeah, exactly. But we've got a shed around here. Obviously, a caravan base was along here, and obviously, electric box just there. And we've got another little shed, which is quite interesting. Well, it's not interesting at all, really. It's a shed. But, um, yeah, you can kind of see what the, uh, the what you call it. It's got another one here. Looks like that's got a couple of blinds, a table in it. But, as you can see, running up all along here would have been storage sheds. Caravans. For caravans, yeah, that's what I mean, yeah. Obviously, we've got the caravans that we've just checked out. We're just behind Emma there. So this was a whole row of caravans. Whole row, whole row of them. There was, there was probably the best part of 100 caravans here. Yeah, do you I reckon? There's about 100. You look at it on Google Maps. I'll insert a picture, an aerial picture of what the caravan park used to look like. Okay, all right. All right. Actually, I'll tell you what, we'll insert that just now. We'll put that into the video just now. But right, you're done looking at that, vid that we picture were just now? Saying, we, that it, yeah. These places are quite eerie because fun places that all the enjoyment that people had and, yeah. and now it's just left like this it's such a shame absolutely yeah so I see what you mean by a theory it's just do you know what it's just really hard to think that there were so many families here enjoying themselves Emma's not listening to a word that I'm saying she's just stopping and not taking any notice at all <laughs> I'm doing my bit there's a burnt out chassis there yeah, yeah look just here Burn that chassis of a caravan. But it looks like over here, just over this side, there might be a little bit more. But it don't look like possibly, you can see there is. I love when Emma goes possibly and maybe. She can see it in front of her, but she just goes maybe and possibly anyway. It's like it must be a Norfolk thing. Yeah. Never, never probably, direct. Probably. It's never direct. Well, that's where the church is, so that must be the back of the church. As you can see just here, got the back of the church. And then just over here, at the back of us are these two remaining intact sort of kind of caravans. Oh, so sad. It generally feels quite sad here. But it's been a pretty good little explore, this one, I think. Out, it? It's not been major, really. But funny enough, our other explore was Haysborough, just up the just literally we can see Haysborough. Check out. Put a link to that video yeah, at the end of, at the the end of this video. 
But yeah. that was worth looking at anyway. Yeah, it was. I'm sure we'll probably put a few scans of other bits and bobs that we've, we've seen. Absolutely. All right then. Okay then. Well, that's from exploring with Emma and on this one. Yeah. We'll see you on the next one. Thanks for watching. Bye. Bye. Every day I'm spending time on the path of 